And we're probably live-ish now. Probably. Maybe. I'm not ready. I have a sword for a cursor. <laughs> that actually is pretty awesome. Hmm. So we've got Slippy. So I think this is a Star Fox game, obviously. I'm seeing obviously. 90s art style here. For a second, I thought this was a chest and the head was missing. <laughs> and then I realized it's a hat. So apparently... Uh, he, very common mistake. So he severed somebody's head and then made them into a hat. I think that's a woman. <laughs> it might be. <laughs> it's hard to tell. Also anime. <laughs> Very common mistake. <laughs> I don't know. You might have a point. There, there might not be any male characters in front of us. It's hard to tell. Hmm. Yeah, that's a, that's I a mean, very... Th I mean, dwarf and women, you know. <laughs> the, the red head there is a definitely a very male character if, I, if I've ever seen. Mm. Mm. <laughs> One of them Bishonins. <laughs> Bishonins. Okay, let's see what we got here. I would not Luna start with game. Luna. We don't Free movement is restricted to your domain. You can only control your squad. Does that make sense to you? You, you just. You, I don't want all these players mooting me. I don't, I don't want no Luna game. The enemy will also employ high-ranking units. Normal. Your field of view will be restricted. A fair battle against the calm. There's never a fair. <laughs> Jeez, easy is fair. Oh. <laughs> I think that's a warning right. sign. That's a warning sign. We'll go with normal. Okay. Hmm. Prologue. Birth. Tutorial. This is a simple Hadrix. explanation and demonstration of the controls. Hadrix. Please play on easy mode. <laughs> Prologue. Birth. Don't you think that's a little bit too far back? We don't. There's some things we don't need to see. We don't need to know. <laughs> we just assume that they were born. <laughs> same. Let's see. Free mode. Same time frame as the main story. Even if main base falls, the game will continue. Your special defense unit will appear when attacking castles. There are no story events. Okay, Choose so this, we'll have a lot of story. Okay. Dungeon Master. Clear Dungeon's a hack and slash type scenario. Huh. Hmm. Huh. Oh well. The, the war. Oh. The wars. No one knows when or how they started. In the lands controlled by humans, some fight for no reason other than a fight. Sounds like my type of guy. Some fight in the name of peace and justice. That's that's Hyrule, that's uh, the King Harkinian. <laughs> Some this fight. peace is what all true warriors strive for. Some fight out of greed to gain more land. Sounds like Wario. And though they're no, fighting... No, he doesn't <laughs> fight for land. Well, greed. <laughs> he fights for gold. He fights for gold. They're golden in his lands. And though they're fighting... Uh... Well, oh, oh, oh. Their very and, uh, and humanity through, is lost. Through their fighting. I said though. I was like, I was uh, like, wait a minute. The sentence is not making <laughs> sense. <laughs> and through their fighting... Their very humanity is lost. The victorious write history to burnish their images, removing all traces of their misdeeds. That doesn't really happen. <laughs> what? I thought history was a lie upon every which everyone agreed upon. I'm kidding. <laughs> I don't care. <laughs> we're, we're not history majors here. We're, we're here for fantasy history, man. You can't get more fake than this. <laughs> As a result, much of what was good has been lost. Territory. Technology. And history. N uh, I don't think he lost any history. I think history happened how it happened. <laughs> and not now, not a single country has managed to exist for more than 50 years. Jeez! How, I hope you don't have many countries in the region. That's a, that's a really quick turnover rate. That's it. I'm making a nation. No more countries. I'm going to build something else. Uh, it, yeah, it's time for a new model. <laughs> Give up, guys. Go home. Uh, this, this, this was not a land for rulers. Yeah. Jeez. Now loading. Whoa, what's all this now? This is definitely the look of a tactics game. I am horrified. I'm seeing... Start player faction. Jeez. Like, I do not like it. Like, it just throws it in your face. No warning. <laughs> no, nothing. Just Oops. flags everywhere. Oops. Okay, I didn't mean to back up. Now, I seem to have a problem. I can't seem to scroll around, but there's clearly more map over here and down below this so fort. So we've got Rhino Empire. We've got the Musk... Musk you named your, your empire Musket. Oh, you there know, we go. There we go. There we go. Okay. Might decide with Muskets. That's, that's, that's a pretty good... That's a pretty promising oh, I name. Oh, i got a castle over here. 
I don't know what any of this means. Macan. I, th- yeah, I thought I was playing a campaign, but I guess I have the option of anybody. It feels like like Nobunaga's ambition, you know? Yeah, no, I, I got a 90s vibe suddenly. Okay, suddenly. so this, this whole thing is a well, faction here. Look at that. Here. A faction called Crime. That is us. If there's ever been a faction. Yeah, that's the one I'm looking at right now. <laughs> we are Crime. <laughs> Floating castles. Marshes. Oh. I like the fact that they're on an island and it seemed to be I'd only have to guard two points to protect this. I mean like like some some utterly comes running up to you, I've been robbed and you're like, Well what did you expect? You're in crime. <laughs> yeah, see now this kingdom down here I would have to defend on three sides. Let's see this, this is this feels more like risk, the risk board with the continents. Yes. So let's see. Unfortunately, a this kingdom, kingdom seems to be one, one frog army. <laughs> oh, whoa! That's... One frog army. I see. I'm pretty sure the crime is the best position I'm seeing. What kind? What kind of frog is it? The one from uh, Chrono Trigger? Uh, is it? Pe- um, is it uh, the Slippy? See, see now this here. Okay, Alfenheim. These are elves. So this would be a forest full of elves. Uh, elves are boring. They seem to have a good army, but you could be attacked on three sides again. Three front wars are the best kind of wars. They didn't no, say that. No, you can be attacked on all four front. Ah, I wouldn't want to have to defend that. Okay, up here we've got one where you'd only have to defend two points again, but you'd have to conquer the snow plains. <laughs> Uh, these guys, these are your muskets. They're pirates is what they are, I think. Pirates! Yeah, they're not situated so badly. Ugh, I wouldn't want to be this. It looks like they've got a... Oh my gosh, they look like they have a giant army. But their empire consists of three towns. The Rhine Old Empire. Not very much of an empire if you only have three towns. So, just judging by what I can figure... I think I'll play as crime. Yay! We made the best choice. We're criminals. The demons who control Dioscurius have maintained their power longer than human history. I thought that you couldn't have a nation for more than 50 years. What's this then? I don't know. But I'm wondering about the Dioscurius. Is that some sort of like some sort of like disease? Like dysentery or something? We control Dioscurius. Oh please! Don't put that near me! I don't want Dioscurius! <laughs> I have a demon lord that has been quietly watching events unfold for a thousand years. What happened to the 50 years? No country has lasted more than 50 years. Here I'm sitting here for a thousand. Well, it's, it's rounding. See, all the con- countries around you have only lasted two years. Clearly, this is the correct faction. <laughs> yes. Difficulty normal. Prologue birth. Faction crime. Are you sure? Yes. Sounds about right. I hope I'm right. The story mode for this faction. What? Whoa! Rejected. What the hell? Rejected. Wow! You cannot. You cannot go into crime. Well, no. I I can play as them. I just don't get a story. Oh! Well, your story was boring, anyways. I like your. You're just running up and down. You're like jumping in spot. I have no idea what's going (laughs) on. Um, recruit maybe. What just happened? Well, I. Whoa! I was. What's making noises? What's going on? The uh, second guy is in that town over there. I said recruit. They got a bandicoot like Crash Bandicoot. I recommend Crash okay. Bandicoot. Okay, this time I can. Okay, let's see. So is this like Bandicoot's of Ancient China where we have heroes? I think these are different pe- heroes. They are. Well, most of them are types of civilians. Retainer. Yeah. Master. Civilian. 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 Joy. General. Yeah, I'd say you want a general. He's only level 5. Level 7. Level 8. Yeah, we've got two generals. Yeah, she's a level 5. Devil. That was general. Awesome. I think those are good stats, generally speaking. Let's ah. go. I can't. Oh, she's light blue. Can you not click on light blue? I guess not. All right, well, fine. I'll take this guy. He's got loyalty 100. I, I, you don't I, know uh, how to recruit. Nothing's working. Maybe okay. we just recruited. I don't know. 
Whoa. Uh, you have a surrender button. That's just a surrender button. On the, uh, didn't John try to make a warning about that? Don't just have a game over button on the front screen. <laughs> this gave you a warning. That would have been unfortunate if he just ended the game. Diplomacy. We're crime criminals. We don't want diplomacy. I have no idea what the hell I'm doing. I don't know what you're doing either. I have either. literally no idea how to play this game. <laughs> I mean, I'm uh, just going to, uh, yes. <laughs> yes. Okay, Easy. let's try this again. We're going to ask tutorial. for the tutorial. Please. Because holy shit. Select the Agnes Empire, yes. Okay. Click the OK button. There is no OK button. Do you mean confirm? <laughs> No, the OK button. Look for it, you fool. Okay. Okay, we've gotten as far as we were. Well, welcome. Ooh. Now, are you a guy or a girl? I'm kidding. Both. <laughs> Both. I'm <a> Both. <laughs> um, I just failed the Pokemon exam. <laughs> <laughs> Professor Oak. <laughs> Professor Oak. Welcome. I'll be your guide for this game of war and politics. Thank you for downloading Lost Technology. What's downloading? No, I don't need to know a tutorial on downloading. Oh my gosh. You've gotten too meta for me. You've gotten too meta. I like your inquisitive spirit. You'll go far. You didn't answer our question. <laughs> this is a tutorial for those unfamiliar with the ways of global conquest. I'm quite familiar with the ways of global conquest. I just need to know how to interact with your Interface. world. <laughs> <laughs> what are manuals and explanations videos? No, I'm not asking that. Please, please. Stop wasting my time. <laughs> you sure do ask a lot of questions. Anyway, let's get right to explaining the basics. First off, regarding the game's major modes. Faction mode. As leader of your faction, unify the continent under your rule. This is the main mode and follows the drama of certain characters. Drama. I'm Ally mode. Drama. Help unify the continent in service of your faction. How's that different? That's not feel like pacifist mode. No, it doesn't. It says it's unified. That's conquest. Mm. There's no dramatic story to distract you from unification. Unify. Now I'll guide you through conquering a few territories. To do battle, you'll need military power. In other words, you must recruit troops. So we're going to use as much of our funds as possible to recruit troops. Don't worry, it's easy. There's only four steps. Uh, uh, uh -huh. I mean, I meant 16. <laughs> Hope you were paying 42, attention. 42, 112. <laughs> Click on the territory where a unit of yours is stationed. In this case, Imperial Capital Oitagi. Okay, uh, who, who, who named this? Who named this? Ort. <laughs> Where Agnes is stationed. Click on the unit you wish to recruit with. In your case, Agnes. I feel like there is a... Click recruit within the characters displayed character I feel there was like a dartboard with names. Just, just throwing them. L letters. Just letters. <laughs> Click on the displayed troop icon to expend funds and recruit them. Recruiting as many troops as funds allow. And you turn by selecting end on the panel that will appear in the lower we right. We can't out expend ourselves? What's the what? point of government? What? You, you got you got citizens to, to make up the deficit. Can't, can't you do borrows and loans and <laughs> We'll just sell some of our people. <laughs> we'll just sell some of your people. There's a crime demon thing. Yeah. I'll take them. <laughs> yeah, that sounds about right. Once you do, you'll move to the next <laughs> lesson. Okay. That's a different recruit member. This is a completely different recruit men menu than what I had before. I would like fire mages. Obviously, that's Whoa. what we really want. Don't bankrupt yourself. You probably need money for other things. Nah, he said spend it all. Here, we'll have a few horses and some infantry. So Somehow the fire mage was the cheapest unit. So I'm seeing, I'm seeing <laughs> uh, magic is cheap in this if world. You, if you see this uh, mercenary guy with the white yeah. hawks, this Griffith guy, I think he's bad news. Don't hire him. Okay. Uh, he might he might win you most of the campaign, but uh, <laughs> I hear it doesn't end well from there. Okay, now now I end. 
Good! You successfully recruited troops. I also don't recommend any campaigns to the north. Campaigns to the north never end well. You're thinking of campaigns into the east, into Russia. Those don't end well. East and north, yeah. I'm seeing the ice, I'm seeing the snow, I'm getting worried. I'm sweating a bit. Incidentally, that panel in the lower right had end written up. Yeah, okay. This panel will be accessible to you when you are on the continent map screen, like you are now. See the continent behind us, achy out for unification and firm rule. Firm. Yes, yes, this land aches to be beneath my heel. You can do a lot of things from the ruler's panel. Like sit. Befitting a ruler, but we'll get to them in due time. Recruiting troops was easy enough this time. But there's something you need to keep in mind. Each unit can only be recruited to certain branches. And squads of each branch can only be used by certain factions. For example, during the main game, only Reinald Empire can use units belonging to the Imperial Footmen and Imperial Cavalry branches. Now that you've built up at least one squad, you're ready to move them to a different area. I'll bring them a place to move to. And that place is... <laughs> Okay, you you are just pulling names out of even he has <laughs> the a ether. question. Even he has a question mark at <laughs> yeah. the end of this. Yeah, are, are you, who, okay, whoever is writing it, you're fired. You're fired. <laughs> the historically low, la poor labor conditions have led to a miner's revolt that needs quelling. Well, quelling. That sounds delightful. Tell me, how do we quell them? Do we let them unionize? Do we give them cash? Maybe uh, improve conditions. Uh, or what, were all those, sword. what were well, all those fire mages for again? <laughs> oh God! <laughs> now, what type of mine is it again? I hope. I hope it's is not. It a, is it a coal mine? I hope it's not coal. Those things can burn for like a hundred years if you set them on fire. More than that, even. What kind of leader would allow things to get that way? You'd better move your squad to nip this in the bud. Actually, nothing is happening there right now. But that's a scenario that could happen. She just happen, jokes about know? it. Just, the person's just like, you know, it could happen. Oh, I almost sent you there to kill all your so men. But I was just joking. <laughs> so let's practice moving squads in case it does. I, I, I think this person has a vendetta against that mine. Uh, workers beware. This so is your boss. So move Agnes and her squad to the Vader mine at the end of your turn. Only four uh, steps. Again, jeez, everything's four steps in this game. Four, deg four degrees of separation and power going on. I'll tell you what's also four steps away from happening. You out the window. <laughs> Drag and drop the unit you want to move into the target territory's window. Okay. Okay, this person is now just rested themselves up to the king. Okay. Ruler. Um, I, I think they have too much power. Okay. Get rid of them. So. No. No, no, go back. Okay. Or maybe they no! have to be you. You here. <laughs> We're fighting the menu. This is menu battle. All right, all right, all right, all right. Let's try this again. Click on the territory where your units are located. Click on the territory you wish to move them to. Get out of my way. Right click right. on units and drag them from their territory window. So, okay. You have to, yeah, you have to, ah, the unintuitive I was left mouse button. clicking. Yeah. You bad left clicker, you. Okay. He said there was an all button, but I'm not. S oh, wait. Nope, that didn't to, work. Have, I think you have to right click it and hold it down. Oh, yeah. Squad limit reached. But. But cavalry, one must have cavalry. All right, in fake drills where there's still actual rioting. There won't be any rioting after our fire mages are through. <laughs> oh no. You moved your squad. As an aside, you can click the X in the corner of the window to close it. Okay. Should we try? <laughs> Game ends. Stream ends. No, don't. <laughs> <laughs> Great. If they're getting in your way. Now, you know how to recruit units, build squads, and move them to other territories. 
You have the basics down. Yay! So it's time to talk about bloodshed! My favorite topic. Let's move on. Through trial and error. That's that's a bad that's a bad name for <laughs> It's time to make errors. I'm good at that. Yeah. <laughs> this is the battlefield. We've got a ah. Oh no. We've got a pile of poop in the corner. We've got a few trees in the north right. Got an army over here. I think that's spilled soda. <laughs> this is the battlefield, well, a field. But a battle could happen in a place like this. Anyway, this is a good chance to get acquainted with the various terrain types. For example, I bet you didn't think that this... That's not a mountain. I know a mountain when I see it. That's a, that is just a tall mound of poop. Poop, poop mountain. River? Really? And here I thought it was a... Uh... Look at that. The river is wider than the mountain. What is, what is, what is, what is the scale? Is true. What is the scale on this? <laughs> Forest! Really? You sure? I don't think that's enough trees to qualify. That, yeah, that's, that's, that's just... And a desert. What's that doing next to a forest? You know, encroaching deserts all the time. They just sneak up on you. Different units are affected in different ways by different terrains. So make sure you know their movement types. Oh, it's so it's Pokemon. easier for you to grasp by doing it yourself. Let's have you move a squad. Did you see that tree? No. Let's move your squad there. Does he mean that? Battle takes place in real time. Oh. So don't walk off for tea and expect to come back and hey, find your squad. Hey, and hey, one did tea. you just assume we were British? You just assumed we were British. That's pretty mean. They, 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 look, look at this, Pete. This is a person who drinks tea on the battlefield. <laughs> you can tell. <laughs> well, everyone's just bleeding and dying. Although I don't expect that tree will put up much of a fight. But you never know. It's going to turn into a boss it's suddenly. End. It's an end. It's going no, to be a boss. it's it's going to drop apples on us. Oh no, it's Kirby. Ah, Kirby boss. Okay, let's get started. There's two steps. Select the unit. Either left click, left click, left click. More exciting will give you command of one specific unit. Later, we'll give you command over an entire squad of units. You're doing very tactical, see guys, right? that commanding a single unit and a squad of units is really not that different. You want it by right-clicking on the spot you want them to go. Whoa, a bunch of buffs suddenly. Uh, well, I am impressed. Well. This um, animation, it's beautiful. Yeah, top tier. Nintendo would be jealous. So, uh, by the way, you can also left-click and... I just did that! <laughs> We're ahead of you. Oh, I didn't notice. I was slipping my tea over there. Mm-hmm. I didn't select all the units. Five squad. Well, now you select all the rear units, the B squads. Horse squads are great for the back of the front. Great for getting close and personal. Whereas the rear squads make up your rear guard and they typically sell range combat. The pretentiousness is coming to an end. To uh, battle! My this isn't, even, this isn't even the army I hired. My <laughs> army was all fire mages with just a few guys. You notice that all units are not moving at the same speed. I, you don't say. I guess the guys with the horses would move faster, maybe? No, those are the slowest. They have... they Like, horses are just really slow, dumb animals. I don't know. Imperial. Definitely the guys with armor should be running the fastest. Imperial foot soldiers and fire mages have the same movement speed, so armor doesn't slow them down none. You're wrong. <laughs> Too many rules. They're slower on certain terrain and faster in cities. By contrast, Imperial Cavalry are planes unit, meaning they move faster on planes and extremely slow in watery areas. But horses do swim. Yeah, too much. Fact, we will see several this. Several units will, will become this. slower in water. Hey guys, guys, if you command. ever make a game, just show, don't tell. Please, please do not have a, there are a person in a cape. Marsh type units. Yes, there is definitely a unit that moves faster marshes. Let me tell you. Well, let's see who would be the best in marsh cave. Orcs, black mage, black mage, black mage, black mages. They won't slow down in water terrain. It will be faster on sea terrain. Must That's, be some fish hold people. on, hold on. Marsh type units move faster in the sea. Um, the fishmen, I guess. Marsh type units are faster at sea. 
I guess so. I don't know. I, I don't make up the rules here. Fine. Are there certain movement types aren't affected by terrain at all? For example, float type units. You're just making up things now. Four? You're just making up stuff now. <laughs> Keeping these types in mind. You leave you free to attack an enemy that's unable to close in attacking range. I am hearing historical accuracy with every syllable put out here. Difference in movement speed can help or hinder the flow of battle. Yeah, okay. All right, so you're really slow in the water. Yay. So the guys in armor are going to be faster than in water than you. No, no, they're slow too. Yeah, it doesn't really, they all seem to move with, everyone seems to move at the same speed in the river. And you can feel, if you feel that your units are taking a long time to travel, you can speed up time. There may be times to have your hands full, even in real time. If you are overburdened, speeding these up can improve the tempo of battle. Press Z to make combat go as fast as possible. The sleep button? Zzz, looks like you're sleeping at the keyboard. Seems to make sense to me. I'm following your sleep. Speed it up. Okay, sped up. That... What's with all these magic ups and things coming out of them? I think that there's somebody casting buffs. It looks like it's coming from your mages. Yeah, you can see them being lobbed from your, your mages. So if I just sat around, I'd eventually become all powerful? Um, it's you successfully arrived at your destination. It took you long enough to notice. <laughs> yeah, we, we, we... Yeah. Yeah, the basics of unit selection and movement down. Yay. Of course. You aren't going to win battles simply by parading around looking magnificent. It depends on how easily intimidated my foes this are. This person found that out the hard way. <laughs> <laughs> Unfortunately. This <laughs> is war. You'll have to attack your enemies. With that in mind, let's move on to unless, using your skills. Unless it's World War See I. that boulder? Then you want to be in defensive all the time. Mm -hmm. Let the enemy army drown in the mud. You'll just stand and watch. Just stand and watch. We'll treat that as the enemy. So it will be your sparring partner. What's that look for? I hear Boldons are fearsome opponents if you get on their bad side. Yeah, I played Breath of the Wild. Let me tell you. So, rocks wait, get up and punch you sometimes. Yeah, that, that, It's that terrifying. Happened. So I imagine halfway through on your way to this rock here, the, the trance going to wake up and have you on one side. The rock's going to have you on the other. I'm seeing an epic battle going on here. I'm, anyway, I'm hyped. Units will typically attack enemies automatically as they come into range, so move your squad closer. Okay. And stop buffing. Save our magic for battle. How do Jeez, I? Jeez, those, those guys are fast. We have to play to see again. Yeah. Um, Break all of our swords on that yeah. rock. I think I think I think he just doled and wasted a bunch of. They've begun attacking straw men. No, around here we fight rocks. We fight rocks. That's the way to train. Train hard, fight easy. Uh, if, no you wonder can sla he... if you can slash and stab a boulder, a human body should be relatively I'm easy. I'm trying to see why you're feared. <laughs> you guys just attack rocks. <laughs> Any enemy army's just looking going, oh God. Oh, what are they going to do to us? What are they going to do to us? <laughs> just like that. When enemy enters attack range, your unit of your unit skills, they attack. Do you notice how each unit is using different skills and attacks? There are several kinds of skills, from close range attacks to rushing attacks, skills and buff stats, skills to reinforce units, and more. Once you're accustomed to battle, you'll find you want to use certain skills over others, depending on your situation. Yeah, yeah, basic tactics, we, we know this. This can happen, you can select skills you want the units to use from the selection panel in the lower left that appears in the unit selection panel. Tell us what we don't know. Don't this tell us what we do. This is also known as the war panel. Uh, it includes all the commands you might want to issue units as they wage war. What if I want to wage peace? Do I yeah, get a peace Too panel? bad. Waluigi time. You can order units to use particular skills by left-clicking the relevant skill icon. Conversely, you can order your units not to use certain skills by right-clicking the relevant skill icons. Okay, I can turn them on and off on autocast either way. Yay. Blah, 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 blah. Go away, guide. You have said too much today. Go back and drink some tea. We're done. I just, I just have to wonder what that offending rock has done to you. Um, whose family has it rolled up on murder? <laughs> Whoa, you're just throwing magic that way now. 
you just not run out of magic? I don't know. I think I pretty much used up everything. Gee, uh, like, you guys are just standing in the way as there's ice and fire just being lobbed over their heads casually. Hey, would you give us some warning? <laughs> oh, you hit Frank! <laughs> of course, you might also want to pick and choose each and every skill by yourself! Yes, that's what Sometimes animation's for. Sometimes a general strategy, such as only using long-range attacks or using only special skills is what's called for. That's where presets come in. You can select presets such as fight or special from the war panel. But we'll get into the specifics of those presets later. This is all you have to know for now. Are you following everything so far? So far, we've covered unit selection, unit movement, range attack, blah, 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 blah. This is the L moment. Please, hit, don't hit repeat. <laughs> we don't want to start battle, this all over again. You might want to aim at a specific spot rather than waiting for the target to come within your attack range. For example, if you want to stifle an enemy advance by clogging a choke point with covering fire. So I'll teach you how to assign an arbitrary target for the attack. Arbitrary? Uh, what, what target has not been arbitrary so far, Mr. Guide? Just select some units, normally would, then left click where you want them to aim. Yep. That feels very arbitrary. It works. It works! That rock. It's good. It's losing. It's losing this fight. It's lo it's dying slower than a gold mine in Warcraft. Man, those things had a lot of hit points. They did. This thing, this rock has more somehow. Once you've killed the gold mine, that gold is destroyed. Yep. No one can ever ever get it out again. Yep. No. Nope. Yeah, no hope. No hope. Makes you wonder who dug up all those mines to begin with. They're just sitting around casually everywhere. <laughs> Good. It looks like you can handle a lot. Of, you have a handle on assigning an arbitrary target. Yeah, but, you should you should know. But it's easy to get a little too gung ho and assigning a target you didn't really mean. Fortunately you can do any rash commands with a double click. Double click Oh, you just killed Frank anyways. That was like okay. thirty fireballs in his direction. Can, can we go now? Let's go. That is the Warcraft selection, the green rectangle. Okay, to recap. No recap. Well then let's finish up here. Let's cover withdrawing. Sometimes there are battles you can't win. Escaping with your unit's lives is nothing to be ashamed of. Click the run command in the upper right of the war panel. Any currently selected units will begin withdrawing. Run! Bravely run away! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Huh? What? Voice, voice acting, no! Japanese. <laughs> All you to see the withdrawal order have reached the edge of the field. They will successfully withdraw. Boop. So, wa Russian, yes. Hello! <laughs> Units will move faster when withdrawing as they are running like their lives depend on it. Do they throw down their weapons? I might have to collect all their weapons after they've run away. <laughs> they can't attack while they're running away, and they can still be hurt or killed until they've successfully evacuated the battlefield. But we didn't. We ran away from a rock. We ran away from a rock. In easy mode. I know. Tragic. This, this is this is worrying precedent. This is designed to make us feel really bad about our abilities. I, I, I'm interested that the fleeing works on any border, not where you came from. A lot of games <laughs> think you go all the way back to your starting point to retreat. This one's like, oh, anywhere. You just retreated to enemy territory. Good enough. Yep. <laughs> 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 uh, better safe than sorry. How was it? Once it was you're tragic. used to it, battles will go smoothly. Or they will, provided you have excellent comrades leaving your squads. Yes, comrade. I see. I see. You, we you are. should have known from the red flag. You should have known. Of course. I was confused because that didn't look like a hammer and sickle. Well, now that I look at it closely, at first it looks like a bird, but no, really. <laughs> I see a pickaxe, and uh, I don't know. It's one of the <laughs> ink blot tests, kind of, you know? <laughs> ink blot tests, yes. <laughs> Except with color. Why did you make a parakeet your flag? We <laughs> didn't. But didn't we already recruit some comrades, you ask? <laughs> oh, no! Dear. See, there are two distinct types of units. You're one of the real nameless soldiers, our troops. I thought he was going to say comrades and bourgeois. Whereas 
comrades. <laughs> oh no. Are people whose names are worth knowing. <laughs> Oh no. And often influential in the story. Hi there. Hey, Alter Gaming. Where? Let's see. Such as Agnes. Comrade Agnes. Most comrades who will be better than troops. <laughs> yes, Even they if are, they are working the same class. class and level. <laughs> yes. Well, troops aren't working class. It's not how it works. Yeah. I don't, I don't know what to make of this. Every time this guy talks, it, it bewilders me I'm more and more. I'm not convinced it's a guy. I'm not I, convinced I, it's a girl. <laughs> I, 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 <laughs> Although We're having they too much will fun, take guys. an experience penalty. Recruiting comrades is a little more complicated than recruiting troops. As with troops, you only have to worry about how which squad branches your fractions can recruit to. Whereas with comrades... The limits on who you can recruit depend upon the unit you want to recruit with. <laughs> Russia simulator confirmed. Yes! <laughs> yes. We're just going to put paper please over here. <laughs> paper please. In case anybody wants to cross the border into my lands. Different units can employ comrades to you <laughs> of different races and classes. Yes, social think about classes communism. and... <laughs> So let's recruit some wandering comrades. That's how communism worked. It's just with wandering comrades in the kingdom. Yes. To employ wandering comrades, first click comrade on the ruler's panel. The recruit window would be would then open. Place your cursor over Agnes in the window and then recruit the name displayed as Balder. Agnes turns into Balder? What? No, uh, she wants to visit Balder's <laughs> gate to recruit comrades. Okay. So... I don't have a comrades button. <laughs> Select to recruit from the bottom right of the screen. <laughs> what the heck is with this translation? They keep telling me to click on things that don't exist. Place a cursor over Agnes. Yes. Click Balder. Agnes. Okay. Then we click on Balder, who's a wandering fire mage. Rear vassal seven. Upkeep 50, thrust anti, blunt anti, range anti. I don't know what the hell any of this means. Fire anti, cold anti. I don't know. Well, that was... Please, repeat yourself. What did you say? I think he just insulted your family. <laughs> your family's honor. I don't know. He's very clumsy. He dropped his stick. That too. <laughs> I was the top of my graduating class at the Imperial Academy of Mount What? Oh, sorry, I've never held one of held one of these before. <laughs> this is this is a magic wand, isn't it? <laughs> I think I think he may be embellishing his res resume. <laughs> Watch out, that thing might be loaded. <laughs> Shoots off a spell. <laughs> he drops it. You successfully recruited an ally. Now recruit the comrade unit Elsa in the same no, way. We're not we're not doing frozen. But take note. Agnes can't recruit her like she did Balder. Cole never bothered her anyways. She, of course she's a nice mate. Of <laughs> course she's a nice mate. <laughs> Elsa is a nice mate. It can only be recruited by Balder. Why? Balder dash. Why? Balder dash. I don't See, believe it. You remember in Bandit Kings, it. The, the recruition between the generals was mysterious until you figured out that it was based on integrity, courage, and mercy. <laughs> Why? And that, that that factored in. Here, it's just... Elsa's an ice mage. And that means they can only be recruited by Balder. Of course. How will I know who can recruit who? <laughs> the ice mage. Balder will be added to the recruiting side. So place... Okay, yeah. So I basically hired somebody, and then 30 seconds later had them hire somebody. <laughs> they enjoy my present. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. So I'm not really after Balder. I just made friends with Balder so that I could get at Elsa. Elsa. Yeah, that's Balder what this just, was about. Balder's the third wheel. We're gonna throw him away after this. Yeah, just just fire him. Okay, thank you for doing the job. Bye. <laughs> okay, what does Balder have that Agnes doesn't? Oh, well. Oh, well! <laughs> this is what I need to know about how your recruiting system works! You can't just 
Oh well. <laughs> it's beautiful, man. It's beautiful. You can't just. I have to know how your systems work. Agnes is great at bringing <laughs> agony. <laughs> uh, okay. Oh, hit refresh. Hit refresh. You're not oh, reading oh, the instructions. Oh, 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 oh. I, 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 sorry. She looks like Luna from uh, or or uh, Star from yeah, Star Ocean. Uh, no, no, not Star Ocean. Um, Luna or Silver Star. Star yeah, that's it. She looks like uh, yeah, 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 yeah. kind of, but not really. I, I just gonna tell my uh, uh, the outfit. Uh, yeah, and the spunkier. Uh, Ice Mage version. <laughs> I'm gonna become the very best mage in the world! Guess what type of mage I am? You're an ice mage, aren't you? How did you know? <laughs> Your hair is blue. And Dang that's it. how you recruit <laughs> comrades. In the main game, wandering comrades are always moving. So it's best to click Comrade each turn to I'm check who's in your you, territory. I'm sorry for you pro-democracy people in the audience. This game <laughs> was not meant for you. Prepare to become comradized. That's all. We are the hate. End the turn. As of this, today, we are now... It feels like there's a little smi smidge of the old Koei strategy games in this, but from, it's... Hey, Hadrix. From uh, today on, we are now the Hadrix and Comrades channel. <laughs> Units under level 5 received training. When did you train them? Why? From where? Paid 100 in upkeep costs. Okay. Payday. Lastly... Let's invade some territory and take it over. Now we're talking. All right. Here it's comes the invasion target. It's time for Mother Ort to take it's, to claim her region. It's gonna. It's gonna be the mud huts. <laughs> the mud huts. <laughs> well, you're gonna see the mean means of production. So. Huh? Huh? What do you mean? Ha? Huh? Fort Margarita fur. Margaret Farter? <laughs> Margaret <laughs> Farter. I like your name better. Margaret Farter. <laughs> okay. Fort Margaret Farter. I see. <laughs> Never imagined I'd be helping someone well, invade Who are it. you? Where are you from? <laughs> Wait. Why did we not see a fort that was just sitting 10 feet away until just now? Sorry. It just reminded me of something that happened a long time ago. Like 50 years ago? When it was to your kingdom? To invade the territory. <laughs> Oh, come on now. She's not that old. She looks like she might be 12. It's anime. <laughs> she might be 600. Yeah, you're right. Anime. <laughs> anime is its own to class. To invade the territory, right-click on the target territory. Wrecked. Remember, left-clicking brings up the territory window, which is useful at seeing who's there. But for invasions into foreign territories, you need to right-click. All right-thinking people will right-click. Left click on your own territory to see which units are Why there. Why do you care which but mouse button we click with? <laughs> because right and left clicks have been given assigned different things. <laughs> just to make this game more, more complicated. complicated. Drag and drop the units to the target's window. Click the deploy button on the upper left of the window. Oops. It's probably not a thing important. So both of you have This is the final exercise. So both of you have have become interested in Fort Margaret Farter's vast tracts of land. This is the final exercise. <laughs> I'm almost proud of you. Almost. Hey, there's I'm not in charge. There's not enough skulls so, burning. So I'm in charge of this invasion, and you're with me on this invasion. Yes. I'm putting you on the front line. You're to catch arrows with your face. Okay? And this, pro this person will probably have pyramids of skulls on fire. <laughs> um, this is... I'm not sure you want them in your front lines. Since we're on a new turn... Didn't, didn't you watch Thor Ragnarok? Don't you know what happened last time there was a, a person this crazy that took a ceiling away from Odin himself? <laughs> As there could be strong ones wandering about. No, this is a, a person for which conquest never never ceases. Mm. There is no peacetime. Okay, let's click our... Comrade. She's button. she's a little bit sad about her hometown being invaded here, but just just a little bit sad. She's more happy that okay. they're invading it and killing people. So I want to recruit Dite Hard. Then she's happy, to, um, sad to see it lost. So the general happiness of the world increases. Boy, they talk very soft. They do. I'll work hard to earn my pay. Eh, good enough. Sounded Elsa.
Okay. Makes so, me think of that Vinland main character. <laughs> I'll go get the general's head. It actually is a good manga. I love that. Awesome manga. Okay. And I guess I may as well spend all my money buying, uh... The oh, Edward! Hold on. How do I hire men again? Good luck. Uh... Debha, they just explained this to me. It was the first thing they said. Okay. No. Oh. <laughs> Go away. Okay. I want my armies over there so I can invade with them. All right. More. 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 We don't defend our territory. It's just a mine. What is, what's, what's the worst <laughs> that could happen? Uh, three seconds later, coal, ah. coal mine explodes. <laughs> Okay, so Margaret Farter has a heck of an army in it. They're all level 10. You're not ready for this. And I, you have a level 15. Dang. Yeah, I can't figure out how to hire troops. Uh, recruit? No, that's hiring comrades. Ah. Hiring regular men. They gave, That was the first thing they explained to me. Right click or something? I don't remember. Well, I've tried right clicking. I've tried left clicking. Have you tried up clicking and down clicking? Oh, well, whatever. Let's just attack. Attack! Okay, so that's what's in there. Deploy. Um. <laughs> yes, 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 we can. We haven't been <laughs> that's our territory. That's a challenge. <laughs> uh, that's, that sounds like a, a deep philosophical question. Guys, um, if we stay here, are we technically invading our own territory? King's like, huh. What? Uh, all the units I sent to walk from the mines are still walking. And that consists of pretty much my entire Everybody. army. So, uh, I need to wait a turn. In. Okay. Now. Okay, there's no roaming comrades. Okay. So, let's do this. Fight for me. My armies. Okay. Uh, yeah, okay. Still Some having of you may die today. The, you all, may all die today. But it is for my greater honor. I want to go back to playing the demons. <laughs> now. You like being crime? You probably, you probably let me but they don't have a oh. story, so we should probably do a different one. Okay, go! Yes. <laughs> Can't see the oh. Oh. Just some parting advice. Oh, traitor! Running off already. You're all going to die. <laughs> <laughs> I was secretly working for them the whole time. Do you remember me mentioning presets in the war panel? First press Sue on the war panel. The summon preset will use all summon skills to call more soldiers. Doesn't matter how many you can call, though. And don't forget about the tech preset. This will make your units use special moves if they have any. Okay. The future of the continent is in your hands now. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. Oh, oh, we're being shot and attacked. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, God. Too fast. Too fast. Okay. Oh, man. We're being wrecked hardcore. Okay. First of all, you guys can back up a little. Secondly, what's this about a Sioux command for summoning? Jeez. <laughs> oh, I thought it was all over already. I just want to just watch you guys get wrecked. Oh, jeez. <laughs> They're all, I like, backing up. Like, I don't oh, think we were ready for this. Guys, uh, this is the best tutorial we've ever been in. We lost range, so quickly. It was amazing. Range. Where was that thing about special techs? I don't see it. Ah. Uh, I see a tech button. Where? 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 Put your finger on it. Fight tech stuff. Ah, 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 ah. Wait, are you summoning bunnies? I fluffy bunnies. There's Snowman. summoning snow. It's Elsa. It's Elsa. It's Elsa. Whoa, whoa. Did you die already? Agnes has withdrawn from oh, what? We didn't hit retreat. 
<laughs> I don't even know! You need to get back down there with your men. Okay, look. Guys! Get your butts over to the battlefield! It was going glorious. For the Empire, <laughs> you just got wrecked and fried. Ah, uh, no! The cavalry just wiped out that contingent of mages. Snowmen! <laughs> you have no chance to win this. You don't say! I can't read your thoughts. Yeah. <laughs> yes, we were wrecked. This was this was beautiful. In our defense, grab we your men, bring them over. Outnumbered. You still have a little bit of contingency. We have some. Keep dreaming or something. Not to be dreamt. Okay, guys. I think we've won. Somehow. <laughs> okay. We were victorious! <laughs> that was definitely planned. <laughs> Good work! <laughs> you, you don't have any units. You, you wiped out. <laughs> you wiped out my enemies. And you have nobody left to fight. <laughs> this situation is exactly what I envisioned when I started teaching you. Yeah. No, now she's just going to invade us all. It's just a small taste. <laughs> of course, you should also be best to look at the manuals. You don't say. Uh, let's meet again in the real game. Okay. I don't know. I, I'm not feeling confident, Hadrix. <laughs> so, uh, I think we should probably stick to e easy. I think normal's too much for us. <laughs> All right. So, uh, I still think... I still think that these guys the over crime here... The family is the only real family. Well, I love the fact that they've only got two points they have to defend. And they have... Well, they've already got this entire continent. But they have no story. We could play the frogs. All right. We Frog could play... Time. Okay, here's a place that only has two points to defend. Let's, but it's awful small. Let's try Mount Scandi. Oh, it's brighter we start off small because we don't know what the heck we're doing. True. I guess we could play these dog people? Sure. Is that what's going on? Oh, I'm sorry, they're the lions. Uh, lions, dogs, same difference. Or we could play the muskets. Muskets. They, I would have to conquer No matter which north. group we pick, it's going to end in tragedy. Let's, let's get the pain over. North. Let's see, the desert is run by... Uh, Castus? Huh. So that's the... He's going to take over the deserts. What is this thing? The Knights of Kunti, K K Kunitz? Hey, 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 you watch... Kunitz? You, you watch your language here. It's C-Units. C-Units? No. C-Units. Oh, it is C-Units. That's weird. <laughs> <laughs> it just Northern, looks very close to an Northern unfortunate word. Kikropia? I don't know what's with this place. So if we t played the Pirates... Fortress of Nachos. I want Nachos. We could go north... And then we could take this nice island here. We'd be able to control six territories without exposing ourselves in more than two That's points. a pretty bad name, Pel Hellas. Hellas Fortress. That's a hell of a fortress over there. Actually, if I take this, that's seven. I could go as far as here. I could expand as far as to here and here. And I wouldn't set plans yet. Points. Not until you know how to recruit. Should you be worried <laughs> about how far you're going to conquest? Look, this is how it works, okay? I was playing as lizards. See, the problem is if I play this guy over here, I have three points I can be attacked from. Like, this is this is this is important. It's beautiful. I'll just just pick one of the school. I think I think this one's okay. Alright, to the muskets. We're okay. now a musketeer. It's probably gonna tell us we don't have a story again. Confirm. An archaeologist discovered weapons known as firearms while excavating a ruin. Intrigued, the, the, the sad thing is that he that, that to use them to win a war and form a technology-based society. The sad thing is that firearms aren't literally your arms on fire. That would have been more exciting. But first, you need to find a way to win the city's democratic election and grasp power. So this game's called Lost Technology. This might very well be the main character intended. I get laborers. There's a fox person. I get laborer, 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 savage dog. Glad I can be funny sometimes, you know? Sometimes I feel like I can't do anything right. Yeah, you are. What is with these random things when you, when that you're putting are popping it over. up? Yeah, it's holding over the name. When you put over the name, it shows you who that character is. So Crooks is the, the fox person. 
Huh. Yeah, they're heroes. So you're a savage dog. I have to say, they have really good art. Yeah. Okay, I'm playing that guy. <laughs> that's, that's probably the leader. That's the leader. Yeah, no, he's got, he's got the big arm, like... Difficulty oh. four stars. Huh. Difficulty two stars. This is our first rival here. Long ago, upset with how it was being ruled, the knights left the empire and created an independent nation, fighting past the oppression and iniquities in the empire. They prompted the idea of justice and justice. fundamental rights for all. Oh no, we can't have democracy at this time. Huh. Get rid of the guy. So you get that's uh that's saber, filing. Hold over a second. That's it. Saber. Down one. It's got the blonde hair, the ponytail, yeah. the art. Yeah, that's saber. Yeah, <laughs> I know saber when I see her. Huh. These two are like level ones. And Sigurd's Sig walls has me worried. Oh, ah, no. Oh. Doggone it game. We, we, it's easy to leave this game. <laughs> okay. An Cast atheist us. created a new religion. An atheist created a new religion. <laughs> Dang well, it. Those darn okay. atheists always making new religions. <laughs> okay. The devout people that deserve to follow based on helping the weak and judging the powerful. Anyway, they gotta go. School tomorrow. They seek a better land to obtain Have new fun. followers. Thanks for coming to the stream. And I'm definitely waving on camera now. Snake. One of your guys just left. Oh, okay. Mm, bye. This is one of the characters. This is a comrade. Ooh, comrade Cobra. That's Cobra almost a commander? commander? I know. It's pretty badass. So, uh, basically these are... I'm noticing a theme. <laughs> you got a veil. What, well, don't get that guy. That guy's a mistake. <laughs> <laughs> I don't trust that guy in charge of anything. This, this guy, what, this guy leading my armies? <laughs> He's a poison mage. That's not poison in there. Well, I guess technically it is. <laughs> okay. <laughs> this guy's very hard. But, I mean, he starts in the desert. It's not exactly a, a good place for farming. Don't assault in him. Okay. The lion. This one's four. East or ice. Has lived in the mountains of Scandi Island for a long time. Five years ago, the people from Port Village land to build new Scandia, a new town in the mountains. There's some fierce confrontation between them and the... Yeah, that. As a result, almost all the males were lost in battle, and many survivors left. It ain't going to be fun tomorrow. We're in school the fun youth anyway. who remained grew up in to continue the resistance. Okay. Well, if school so, ain't fun, make it fun. Find your so, friends and have, um, hang out. So these are the dog people. Um, I was back when I was in... <laughs> That's one of our comrades, is it? Yep. Uh, back when I was in high school, I just I ran an anime club. Um, not surprisingly, since I'm full of anime references. Uh, I also Funny, later started I a Doctor... that, too. I also um, later did a Doctor Who club. Hmm. Um, but um, it's... Running the clubs is kind of what uh, led me to have... I enjoyed the shows I was running across, but also just... Let me meet more people of the same. <laughs> this is one of the easiest ones and to play at school. more enjoyable. The Kingdom of Gug. That is Somehow a lot. that guy looks badass, and I don't know why. I, I mean, it's, it's probably all the medals. <laughs> and the poses are pretty strong. <laughs> oh, no. Comrade! Anime, you've gone too far. Comrade Charlotte. <laughs> okay. Her positive nature causes her to sing whenever she's happy or if it seems like rain. Ribbiting. Uh huh. A girly, dreamy, starry eyed tree frog. Okay. Okay. I've had too much anime for today. <laughs> Blue toad. Okay, I kind of like the frog people. <laughs> oh, that's why I lost battles versus frogs. Okay. King of Frogs. Kingdom of Gug. It has never been invaded by other countries. Yeah, you can see why. <laughs> yeah. Draw me we're like almost, you. We're almost through all the options. Dragon Tamers. Ooh. It's four star. Okay. I would be tempted, but my gosh. One thing surrounded with all of this. 
Okay. Alcatraz. <laughs> okay, I have a new favorite. We're running Alcatraz. A penal colony. You don't say. Criminals and sent to exile. Mm-hmm. Still known as criminals generations later. They co plot constantly to one day retake them. The only thing that would be better than this if, if, is if they were Arkham Asylum. <laughs> I totally played that faction every time. They've got they've got a random elf in their numbers. They've Pirate. got pirates in their numbers. They've got humans in their numbers. Dwarves. Dwarf. they got kind of a little bit of everything. They're the crazies. And, of course, there were these. The demons. The demons. Yeah, they don't have much... Uh, they don't have story yet. Their difficulty is one star. They are... I looked at the map, and I figured they would be the easiest, and they're listed as the easiest. All right, we're going to go with muskets. So, we have a dog. Yeah, dog. A Green hair. Mercenary. At least he's holding on to his magic wand, unlike uh, the last guy. Human. Mercenary again. Um, lady... Get a new set of pants. Yeah, I'm sorry, no, that's just so not working. <laughs> she, she got in a fight. You also need a new shirt. Maybe I'm sorry. She, maybe she can regenerate. Maybe her leg got cut off and it just regrew and she yeah. just put her boot back on. I, I just refuse. She needs she needs a new boot and she needs what, a new shirt. <laughs> What's she got in her hand? In in what are those? It looks like firecrackers. Vials. Those might be candles. Firecracker things. Hmm. What about this? She uses a bow, even though we're supposed to be the gun faction. She's got a bow. She's got a sword, and she's got. She's just kind of all over the place. She's this just a weapon master. A wizard, at least. Yeah, but at least he's holding on to his wand, unlike the last guy. The last guy had to drop it all over the place. <laughs> all right, so let's see. A mercenary and self like rifle <laughs> archaeologist makes his money as a mercenary because archaeology doesn't pay well enough. He became interested in the muskets he found in some ruins, and his interests are shooting and reading. He has some skill with languages and is able to read old script, primarily concerned with finding games and entertainment that have died out. Hey, a fellow gamer! Hey, Drix, you're not reading between the lines. Do you know why he likes books? Because he can shoot them. <laughs> they don't have any pictures of them. You saw Gaston. That's a Gaston type if ever I saw one. <laughs> Convinced the ruins tell of a time when there was great peace. He's determined to end the fighting. He's the type of person that acts first and thinks later took on the task of establishing the military organization of musket. You got you need to figure out you, you guys need to figure out how to, to 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 wardrobe yourselves. I mean, he's wearing patchwork armor, she's wearing god knows what. She's got bandages no, on her right no, no, arm. No, this, <laughs> that, no she dug up those pants. Those are remnants that they dug up. See, yeah, this, this was faster than the This is a fantasy world and she found a pair of blue jeans. It was like, "Oh! I am fashionable." One of Lars comrades like Magnet, helps out with Lars's excavation, but has no interest in archaeology. Often works together with Lars and Magnad in a three-man team, taking jobs and earning money together. Often steps in with advice and calms Lars down when he's about to lose control, but isn't above delivering her iron retribution when he try. Should he try to be reckless? Yeah. For that reason, she's rumored to be controlling Musket from the shadows. That sounds like bad innuendo. Never mind. Eh? <laughs> Never mind. Mm -hmm. Megan. Lars, close friend and partner in crime, orphaned in the same war as Lars and Margaret, and grew up together with them, forming deep bonds, self-taught in the way of magic. Gotta watch out for self-taught mages. Having a basic understanding of many types. Perhaps because it does of look rather arrogant. Perhaps because of the death surrounding them, many mercenaries have strong sexual impulses. Well, what, what, the, what? How are these two linked? Even so, Magnat is on another level. So, often planning group dates to celebrate for victory celebrations. I, I'm seeing some interesting psychology going around here. Um, being surrounded by death makes you have strong sexual impulses. Uh, okay. Is it? Is this necrophilia? Whoa! What's going on here? <laughs> That's some lines. Some things. I. Just stop. <laughs> uh, that word again. An archaeologist working to help Lars, bucking the conventional wisdom I that... No uh, it's, it's a lycanthrop, basically. Have oh. less intelligence than humans. She has a keen grasp of several subjects, able to accept and understand almost anything Lars has to say with an accurate, calculated way of thinking. Unlike okay. Lars' friends, crook, crooks hit it off with Lars when the two first met while exploring the same ruins. Rather introverted, she admires Lars' ability to act without overthinking. 
Didn't we just get told that he was unstable and gets reckless? <laughs> That's that, that seems overreacting to that. me. <laughs> okay. Not available. Aww. What the hell? I'm playing Lost Technology as the people who actually dig up and use Lost Technology. And you do not have a story for me. Um, this is a definitely an ambitious game, so I wonder which factions do have stories, considering it have like 12 factions. I guess it's still in development. All right, let's yeah, see. It feels like early access in a way. It might be. Uh, I don't know. All right, let's see. Recruit! Mm, hold on a sec. <laughs> hold on a sec. Okay. So. Battling the recruit. Level 10. So, too bad we don't spend okay, any time no in the No roaming comrades. No roaming comrades. No roaming comrades. Because I figured that there would be some aspect about building up your capital to recruit stuff that's typical in tactics games. Yeah, I don't see any way to build up my stuff. Well, it wasn't covered in the tutorial. If I want to go this way, I have to fight a whole Monkeys. lot of... I don't know what those are. Foxes? Foxes? I don't know. Level 1... Um, it seems easy, easy battle, but don't take too many men because you leave yourself unguarded. Uh, over here, we got a whole bunch of pirates. Yeah, but they're neutral factions. I don't know if they, neutral factions can attack me. No telling. To Two of out. my cities have no units in them right now. Two of my things. I feel like I need to clear up north, and I just have to defend these two points. Sounds good. Go for it. Attack! Max level 9, level up 2, high level plus 1, earnings, I have funds. This is driving me crazy that I can't remember how to hire. I need to recruit regular units. Hmm. Well, we shall experiment. I need to hire men. Just generic troops. Somehow. Keep that's not under, under the recruit option. I know, right? There's four steps. There's click on the town you want to buy in. Um, then something, 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 something. Uh, recruit? Here's the recruition button! I have to click on a unit, then click on recruit. Okay. So, she can recruit wild dogs and laborers. Uh, don't you mean well, dogs and comrades? No, I comrades are over there. I, 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 I know, I know. The laborers. Oh, never mind. Bowman. Yeah. Okay, I he can hire apprentice musketeers. All right, musketeer twins. He can recruit snow mages. And you recruit archers. Okay, so um. I'm going to recruit a few snow mages. Oh, reject it. <laughs> okay. Oh, there we go. Okay, fine. I guess he's the only one who can do it. Well, I'm not going to hire laborers to go to war. Money? Why would I worry about money? Well, you got to be able to pay people up to every turn. If you don't, you'll probably start bleeding out. Whatever. We're just figuring this stuff out. Okay. What? Can I do battle on first turn? It just said. Fine. You just under nine have received training. Well, oh, they went to battle. Well, on their first they turn. went to yeah. battle on their first turn. Whoa! What was that? Um, that crazy-looking lizard thing looked awesome. Let's fight. Okay. See, I have more money now. Okay. Eat the foxes. Attacking the forest of Tully would what now? It, it gives messages way too fast. Okay. okay. So, uh... All. All right. Go with that! Yes. I wish I could read that. Are in front of these guns. 
So we're getting big speed ups and things. Probably. Uh, and they got a five uh, no. Uh, no, I just want one. I'm right, fine. Whatever. I'll take a whole squad of dogs. Here, you guys. I you just need, need to speed up. I'm trying to scout and not get eaten. Okay. Our plan is, since we've got a lot of muskets and things, our plan is to catch them in the water. Okay. All right, you've already explored about half the map. Up. Oh, okay. They're out here somewhere. They're all going to be grouped this together. This is my fault. They're there. They're there. I need to lure them. It's I'm not sure you're going to be able to do it faster than you. Than you. Yeah, that could be... That's wrong. <laughs> Are we throwing rocks? Yes, they are faster than Run. you. Run! 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 They're just sitting back there buffing. No, I want to catch them in the water. You know what I mean? They bring your guys closer to the water. You're the only one who's going to be able to do it. Okay. It begins. Okay. It begins. <laughs> Keep going! Don't turn around! <laughs> it's still throwing rocks. Okay, that worked better than I thought it would. Ooh, I lost a few guys, but... Paid 300 and what? Uh, upkeep or something? Shouldn't I have gained money from looting the forest? Yeah, that's what I do I get things. from having the forest? I'll just assume... We may never know. I'll just assume it gives me more money. Okay. So they've acted so I don't get to make another attack this turn. Yep. Okay. Yeah. A whole bunch of ranged units on a river. The river slows them down. Just seemed like the obvious way. Are you I, sure you're not from Record of Lotus War? That, By the way, that, that is one badass thing you're wielding. I don't know what that was. But... A little bit too heavy on the cutscenes. Cut, these are cutscenes? Well, the battles are from all the generals before they enter. It's a bit unnecessary. They show it every single time. It's actually ridiculously fast. I don't know how to keep up with that level of information. You can, but it's, like, it's I would, kind of an overload. Yeah. I, said I, would, I wouldn't show the generals every time going before battle. Okay. Ahem. Same dealie. No, I spend I spend way too much time thinking about video game design. So she lost two things, but otherwise, I'm sure she's more <laughs> tougher now. Katani,捕らわれない傭兵の戦い方を見せてあげる。十の前に慌てふためけ。常に周囲には気を配ってください。終わったら部下に酒と女を用意させるか。Okay. All right. Being invaded. Okay. Uh, well, we will just have to overpower them through sheer. Wow, they didn't kill anyone. We just slaughtered them. Yeah. Wow. Well, cotton corner is yours. Well, okay. Uh, win. Win is a win. So now we'll have to move, and we'll want to take these two. We're doing good, so great, not knowing what we're doing. It's amazing, isn't it? Well, I know how to kill foxes. Now we have all the mink coats we could want. <laughs> the knights of what now happened? No, no, stop, slow down. Oh shit. <laughs> um, they want peace for 500 gold? Uh, there can be no enough. peace. several times before you can guard yourself, so... Well, I can move my units, and then I can hire the ones, but yeah, no, holy shit. Oh, whatever. We'll be friends with the dwarves, they're far away. Can I get somebody to pay me? Yeah. So, uh, holy shit. These guys really expanded. Yeah. Out. I think we're in trouble, guys. All right. We didn't know what we were doing. 
We still don't know what I we're mean, doing. Come on, what was your first two turns gonna be? I mean, come on. This is gonna like Nobunaga's ambition. Just <laughs> everything's over before you Ooh, know it. There's a comrade dragon tamer there. Still no comrades living in the woods or anything. Yeah, you 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 got the the comrade free zone. All right. Where's their camaraderie, guys? Make an army in castle. All right. Uh, in castle? I don't know how to make a castle. But no, I mean, it's in one of the territories. Make a put an army there. All right. Retire. Seems seems good advice. Okay. So. Hopefully this is good enough to hold. And then over here. No, 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 not that, that. Stop that. Oh my gosh. All right. Then we're yeah. going to take these and put them there. Okay, you think um, put an army in the fortress. Okay, now. So. How are your people? Not that kind of recruit. I'm trying to get this guy, but I can't recruit him. Nobody will give me the dragon tamer. Alright. So I cannot have. Okay, I have lots of money. <sighs> this game is fast. I suppose, in theory, I should have some guys to be sacks of hit points. Okay. They're all level one, though. Well, I know. Two, 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 level threes. Now I reach over here. But I don't care. I guess this army is going to be stuck with nothing but laborers. Your economy is going to be so good. Oh, here we go. Laborers. Hopefully you have enough jobs to keep up with your labor demand. Okay, here we go. Okay, this is how I can hire musketeers. I can have musketeers hire musketeers somehow. Ah. I know how to fire a gun. Who's interested in joining me? Whole bar goes aye. <laughs> okay, are they going to attack me? Probably. They've been ridiculously expansive. Everybody's been expansive. The game you got to learn fast. There is no oh, mercy. The elves are... We're in trouble, though. We're not even hard. The frogs... Whoever read oh, is... The frogs can eat oh, them. Yeah. Ooh, they, they just fail. Seems so. Armies just being eaten. Okay. We weren't ready, guys. We weren't ready. Um, okay. They were no kidding. Fifty year <laughs> expiration date. Um, by the way, how Blizzard long? Lizard Rogue. How, how long have you been ruling your empire for? Are you hitting that fifty year mark? Certainly feels like it. <laughs> I can't they recruit! Will just, they will just take a castle and you lose. So if you, it looks like if you lose your main fort, um, it's game over. I don't know. Well, that's what he seems to be saying. I don't know. All right, let me see. So what do we got in well, here? Well, we'll find out the hard way. If I'm um, losing your fortress okay. ends the game, what, capital. What are these? Um, then that okay. will be how our first game ends. So they've got fire mages and knights here. Ooh. We're still in the, the learning rule stage. Hmm... Yeah, I have itchy nose syndrome. Uh, itchy, 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 itchy. I might be able to attack northern whatever it is. So. Attack! We have no mercy. I don't know how this is going to go. And Play out. Their strength is rated at 9,000 and mine is rated at 6,000. If, if, if you're in defensive, you probably have walls and stuff to guard you because you're in a fortress. Yeah, uh, their, their stuff seemed to be better than mine, but 
fighting defensively might be better. My stuff also has a lower level. Okay, now my strength is 7,000. So many things can conquer so quickly. So I think we probably lost a few players already. You're way over there. No. Okay. I only have one enemy, so if anyone else wants to be friends, alright, fine, whatever. It'll be the price of two and a half guys. Didn't we get enemies with you earlier? This one's gonna get wiped out very soon. Uh, he's running by large. These lizard people are really kicking ass, but they don't they've spread themselves real thin. You had to mess out there. Oh boy. Yeah. Now they've put themselves up to ten and twelve thousand respectively. Still, I think I'm able to do this now. Go ahead and dry. That's all we can do. So this will be an act of war. All or nothing. Yes. Wait, did it say something about reinforcements? We were able to reinforce. Uh, 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 okay, okay, well, well, well. <laughs> 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 Gosh, these controls. There we go. And you guys need to move that the way. No, no, just a little. Ah! Holy crap! I have a hard time with this. Okay, like that. Okay. <laughs> They're still giving us our compliments to each other. That's how fast the attacking was going. Uh, okay. uh, you guys together. Get your butts over here. Ah, uh, shit. Is that was that, the reinforcement. Yeah, that was the reinforcements. They said reinforcements. Yeah, they were kidding. Run into the top right corner. Hold on, I'm looking around at what's left. Not much. Because all that's left is these enlistees and these mages. If I could hit the mages with something. I don't think, I think you lost it. It's these knights that did all the damage. Not a lot then either. You just lost them. Fire mage. <laughs> the guns are picking them off easy. They were all really low level. 
It was those knights when they hit my rifle and just decimated my arm. Don't call me surprised. I thought for sure that it was like, oh god. It is a very ugly mess. First aid and porcelain bombs. Muskets and swords. This funny thing, he gets a lot of bombs like Bomberman. <laughs> Yeah, no, we've but our army is devastated and a counterattack will take us out. Yeah. I wonder how long it takes for the leader to heal. At least you have a buffer. Okay, so from this point you step in and oh snow wolves. <laughs> you can recruit, recruit wolves or fifty of these. So we immediately are <laughs> Higher! Higher! Replenish! Our army is um, not very strong right now. <laughs> but, 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 their army in their fortress is four guys. <laughs> they have to reinforce before they can attack. Yep. You also gotta look at the IO. And they just lost one army, which means that, you know, they've got, they've overextended themselves. Mm -hmm. They're going to have to, they can't pull units from here or they'll lose this place. Here, they, they, look at how many places they have to defend themselves on. They don't even have, they don't even have anyone defending this prison island, which is right next to Alcatraz. <laughs> oh, prison island, that sounds like our kind of place. It does, actually. So... They shouldn't be able to take this back from me. They shouldn't even be able to afford to. Oh crap, there they go! Prison Island's gone already! Good jailbreak. Oh, Ryan Old Empire's dead. Remember, I kept pointing at Red and saying they were in trouble? Yeah. Okay, Alcatraz took a hit there. Okay, now they're shifting everything around. Dwarves versus elves. Elves got crushed. Drug it out there, guys. This is war. Okay. So. So this held. Okay, you lost a point here. Yeah. It looks like the Agra's Ar Island is open. Okay, these guys have, have made themselves and have, have been incredibly dumb. Yep. The dwarves. Yep. Yeah. So it looks like Argur Island might be empty or next to you. Argur Island? Oh, no. Okay, I thought they moved people out no, of there. No, they've actually been reinforcing it. It's up to 16,000. It's ready to hit me. Look at that. Me. The port town is completely cut off. Yeah, this one's 12,000. Which town? Port Hapsperia has been completely cut off. Yep. Yep. They're in trouble there. They've only got 7,000. That's a loss. Yeah, no, this empire's falling shortly. And this, okay, they put their strongest st armies against mine. Yeah, they know you're coming. They outnumber me by 6,000 here and by 5,000 here. They can hire my men so they won't outnumber you as much. Yes, that's what has to happen now. Okay, please, let's recruit him. I really would like to get him. Why can't I ever recruit anybody? It's not cool enough. I don't know the rules to recruiting. Yeah. I just I just don't know the rules to how how I rec how what determines whether I can or can't have. All right. It looks to me like they are preparing for an attack either on me or straight down into this, which well, only is barely holding. So I'm going to start... Call his bluff and start adding men. Okay. I'm going to apprentice mark musketeer. I can't recruit any. Or is your garrison full? I don't know. How much money do you have? I have 5,700. 
but nothing's happening. See? Hit Bowman, I guess. I can't recruit that. I don't hmm. understand. It's not letting me recruit, and I don't know why. The other place I need to put men is over here. But if I can recruit here, then what I can do is send some over. I can ship them exactly. I don't move over. Try selecting your leader and buying with her to level eleven. Kitsune. Mm -hmm. Her? I tried. Oh, okay. I was trying with uh, this one. Okay. Okay. So. Okay. Oh, these must have become a more advanced type of rifleman from our battle. Look at them. They gained a lot of levels in that fight. Yeah. Level 18, level 18. Madness! So Madness. I'm actually going to send over this squad, led by somebody who's got some level. There. Okay, that went over that time really somehow. Really weird on hit detection. I'll have to sit there and play with this a while to figure out exactly what's going on in the ins and outs of this game. A lot of price. <laughs> okay, I'm happy with this. I spent practically all my money. Okay, so we're looking at... This one's up to... Yeah, the, I, I basically reinforced both of them. He outnumbers me on both fronts significantly. But if he attacks me, he opens himself up. Yep, so he's going to sit. And this is a softer target. So if he wants vengeance for my conquest here, I may this, this loss may have been what breaks his empire in yep. the long term. Maybe. He might come for me just out of pure pure spite. spite, but if he doesn't, it's not in his tactical best interest to do it. Dog people are doing well. The frog, frog people are doing well. Ah, they did a joint invasion to reclaim their thing to link up. Yeah. Sense. I didn't know you could invade from multiple towns. That's and cool. they just got hit down there and held. Everyone's making friends with the frogs. Everyone's like, oh shit, the frogs! The frogs, they come in. They bring, they bring plague. They bad news. Men, I can't believe how well they're doing. Uh, uh, somebody said they play lizards, and the lizards are really good to play as. Well, they're currently the most powerful force on Earth, except for the demons over here in crime. <laughs> yep. Who have not made a single move. They're just sitting. Well, the, you did get worried that she's been watching for the last thousand years. He's just going to keep watching with the binoculars going, yep, yeah. pretty cool, what's going on over there? So at the moment... At the moment, even though I fought them, my relations are worse with the desert people and the demons. I have really high relations with the dwarves, though. Yeah. The lion is almost dead. I might have only 5,000. I don't know what alliances and all do, though. You get amity and you get ally, which are different. So amity, I guess, is a temporary friendship, and ally is a, a deeper friendship. I think it... I don't know. I know what's going on with all that. Okay, so you're up to... You stead, stayed steady there. Okay, you held here. Barely, it seems. You retook that. This might be a good turn. Alright, so I think they come at last if you defeat all kingdoms. So they're the last... Oh, they're, they're ah, okay. They're passive-aggressive uh, for most of the game. Well... They could be like Gao Q and just find money from you at a time. The demons, the, the crime has... You've lost 500 to crime. Alright. Um... Tectonic mage. Ooh. I want a mage who can shift the continents. I want a mage who can move the continents and cause earthquakes. Please! I can't nope. have. 
Well, the forbidden art of hiring people is eludes you. Oh, now you hire. So it appears. Ah, arbitrary. Um, I'm wondering if okay, it's made, if that's the limits. So what it feels like it's made in RPG Maker somehow. Uh, it doesn't feel that way to me. I don't know. It's just some of the aesthetics just keeps giving me that vibe, and I don't know why. Um, though, I would... Alright, this is a limit of how many units I can have in these two. I could start hiring more units back here, but I think I'll just sit on money, and then when I take a city, I'll immediately hire. I can't do a joint attack from multiple vectors on anything. And I won't be able to move and attack twice in the same turn, so I see no reason... You're just kind of waiting to see how the scuffle ends up down there, because he's on the defensive right now. This army is stronger than this army right now. It just benefits you to sit for the moment. I think I think I need to, yeah. Well, if I have more money on hand, I can hire more upon taking the place. Yeah. And then it'll be guarded. Oh! oh. Really? They must have gotten more units because I had the stronger. <laughs> Wait a sec. What is this mass? What is this mass? It is your mass. What is this mass? Okay. Why can't we see our own lands? Guys, we have no idea what's going on. We have nobody in our towers. Come on, guys. What the hell? Select, move. Do you have it paused? No, I don't. Time is passing, and I'm not moving. Oh, there oh, we go. wrong button. That's why. Yeah, we have nobody in our towers. We can't see the land. Okay. This was a bad I idea. We should assume we shouldn't have had a group meeting in the uh, center of our town like that. That seemed to have been a bad idea. Oh, oh, okay. Would have helped to have known which direction these guys were talking and attacking from, guys. Yeah. Really? What are you doing? Good question. Whoa, shit! What was that? Oh, that was a mega new spell. Oh, the good attacks. <laughs> that's the, that's what I built around. Living the fires. Okay, good. Yeah, my Sammy, like you're, you're just winning with musketeers. Your musketeers are the this one. Okay, wow, they're hitting me in both places. Okay, here they could potentially outnumber me. Yeah, but you're like I said, they're, they're, this was a really dumb move on their part to lose both their armies. Spite. Spite. Yeah, versus guns. Isn't that a book about that? <laughs> I think I remember that battle being one-sided. Yeah. Well, if I'm using muskets and they're using... Uh, an author from a, over 100 years ago this was a bad idea. <laughs> if I'm using muskets back then, they had armor that had bullet proof. A bullet proof was a dent in the could stop a bullet. Pull back, guys. You're being torn up. Get those muskets. Oh, more knights, more knights. Oh, shit! They knew you were do that. That was the worst thing that could have hit. Our muskets, as long as the knights don't get hit. Yeah, keep, keep your muskets together. They okay, they're retreating now. That's you have fine. One. Yeah. Okay. So defended both points. He's in a world. Hopefully, hurts. we gain some levels. Yeah. Oh boy. <laughs> yeah. No, no. He's in a world hurts. He just ate, he used up all his army. He's just ready to be conquered at this point. Yeah. He tried to. That was a spite. A last minute gambit. That was a spite. If he could have taken my uh, my little island here, he'd have been in a great board position. But now, okay, he's still got. Ooh, wow, twenty three thousand. He has massed everything he has here. 
He hates you. He really hates you. He's just like, yes. I, I might go down, but not by that guy. <laughs> yes. Well... Hmm. I don't know whether it's better to play offensively or defensively. You need to take territory, clearly. It, seem, it seems like you're going to have to. Okay. So what I'm going to do... I know, this game is going rather well. I, I expected you to be like out, blown out of the water by like, round eight for, for like riots happening in your town, people throwing over, you were taxing them too high. <laughs> it's like, what happened? You don't know the okay. rules of the game, do you? All right, I'm able to recruit more powerful units now, but that was expensive. Okay, I've got 19,000 here. If this survives the next turn, I can easily step in and take it, and then I can mm -hmm. hold here. Yeah, it's going to be bad when you're next to the, the, the desert people. But up here we have a problem because they outnumber me. They're going to attack you again Two next to turn. one. So, start hiring. Yeah. Oh, you only have 825 funds. Oh, that's not good. Well, we have alternatives. Yep, and you broke. Okay. See what I can do is since I'm through. so strong here, I can afford to transfer here. Uh, I'm gonna send I'm gonna send a squad of my best Rifleman. Oh, oh yeah, it is yeah, those guys were maxed. Fine. I'll send some of my best melee. You guys don't have very long lives, but you are brave. Yeah, well. I'm sure that this place can hold over here on this side if they try something. Okay, that's it. I'm not allowed to have any more than eight squads here. But everybody here that's not a new hire is pretty tough. The nice thing about um, strategy games is that you get news immediately of what all everybody's up to and where they are. Real war time, you didn't know sometimes if your town was invaded for weeks. Yeah. It's like, oh, by the way, third of the country's now gone. This might be a loss. It might be. I can't really do a whole lot about it because the squad limit is eight here where they can have 18 well, squads. I, I, if they take, and that's just... If they take Ope Creeper, you just return to Fort, Fort of Nachos. I like Fort Nachos. Yeah, well, they really should be planning to fight in other directions against other people. Ooh. But yeah, they can have 18 squads, and I can only have 8. Did I just see mushrooms over there? Maybe. Yeah, nope, they just hate me. Alright. <sighs> よし。稼ぐぜ。ごめん。皆を守れそうもない。逃げよう。マスクって結構。結構。ああ。勝ってんな。お前ら何に打ち取った。この感じだとかなり稼いだな。Now <笑> You're about to be broke. That's a lot of drinks you're going to have to buy. <laughs> okay, it's so going to kick open a barrel. Awesome, they, lost some, but they, lost they lost a lot. lot. They didn't hit with their whole army. They hit with a small force. They just slapped you. The muskets, they're ridiculous. Yeah. They're definitely a power unit. We'll fight together. We'll fight together. The elves, everyone's ganging up on them. 
but they are, seem to be pretty strong. Still, they can't fight a three-front war. Oh, boy. Okay, he's done for. Oh, dear. The desert just lost multiple things to lizards. Yeah, nope. You're going to have to deal with lizards next. The lion guy is down to a single point. It's going to be deserts, and the lizards are all the way out to the middle of the desert. Hadrix, Hadrix, Zuckerberg is after you. Zuckerberg? Ah, CEO of Facebook. Yeah? Something called a lizard man. He's called a lizard man? <laughs> Just a meme. Oh, okay. Uh, okay, they have they have zero units here. It's for how robotic and awkward he comes across in all of interviews and stuff. Okay, they've given up Port Hespera. They're trying to hold this sea with a skeleton crew. For the, re the, re the rest of this Let's Play, the Lizard Man shall for henceforth be known as Facebook. Okay. I'm going to try to take this island. They're coming to dox you. They this... want to know the secrets of your musket. I don't know if I can take this. <sighs> You're ignoring all my jokes. I'm sorry. Too much um, paying attention I don't and actual thinking. I don't understand your jokes. They're weird. <laughs> Oh, I just explained it to you. Okay. Yeah, well. There are four guys. I can't pass any of them. Why? You're just not cool enough. Maybe if you'll Google, Will you'd be cool enough. Will not as their master, Albert, is roaming in a different faction. Did not serve under must gets master due to poor affinity. A affinity with must gets master. 100 best, zero worst. What does that mean? Yeah, I don't get it. That's that's something to read up on the wiki later. There's a wiki? Probably. More surprising when something doesn't have a wiki. <laughs> I don't get it. Try it better. Oh. 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 Huh? Oh, I think Dr. Jerry Ross is saying he didn't get the jokes. Eh. All right. I'm going to give it a shot. It's it's more recent meme stuff. Uh, if, if you type in uh, Zuckerberg from uh, Facebook, he's got... We've got some funny clips and stuff associated with him. All right, we're going to go with this. That, uh, uh, all the weird theories that he's secretly uh, a lizard person and whatnot. Uh, I don't ridiculous, know. but he I, doesn't help. He does I, not help things. I, he's just really awkward. I, I really don't know how this is going to go, I definitely don't want my guys out in the water. I'm sorry. Like, I myself, I'm awkward. I'm not that level, generally speaking. I can't keep our friends together. Don't be afraid of me. Don't be afraid of me. Don't be afraid of me. do あ、I said I wasn't sure how this was going to go. <laughs> I wasn't kidding. So far, I'm definitely winning by a mile. Okay. wiped out when they did the you, you gotta figure out how to use your hero units to do stuff like that, because you probably have special attacks. I'm like, I'm playing musket. I, I use guns. The future is guns. Musket has captured. Yeah, here's special goodies. Use them. Yeah. Okay. Um, no, they're just like the heroes are just like anybody else. They're just there for decoration. All right. I have not a single melee. Uh, this is it for melee right here. Yeah. Um, who wants to be a melee guy? There's nobody in the town. They'll all just run. It's like they know better. <laughs> so. I can't hire any of these. Why not? So I've got squads 8 of 8, I guess. Maybe that's why. No, 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 no. I need... Okay. Your army levels up when, uh, with you and get upgrade every 10 levels. Okay. 
I need <laughs> 2,000 for a musketeer level 10. Yeah, that's expensive. All right. Try to let them survive. We're trying. <laughs> we are trying. Hey. We just don't know what we're doing. Okay. Okay. I have the strongest army in this area now. This guy's completely cut off. He can only attack my capital, but every single turn his army is getting smaller. Yep. He's down to three territories. If I can hold here and your, your two if points. I can I need this. Yep. I can have eight squads here, but this will have eighteen. If I can hold here, he can potentially attack me from multiple directions, of course, which is unfortunate. Yeah, you, you, you open yourself to a three-way. But that's only if they're all held by the same faction. Yep. Which they're not right now. I think that this island and this, this fortress are the places to hold. Peach's castle for a moment. Kind of like the frogs for yep. some reason. He's hit me again. Blood for blood. Oh, yeah. he, he knows. 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 Right. He's still got the bulk of his army. Oh, yeah, that's right. Yeah, come towards my guns. Now the meat wall comes forth. Ooh, you want the all range? Maybe a musketeer is shooting. They're shooting. Okay, well, some of them are south island. Right? Oh, you're just really terrible with your guys. That's why you have the meatballs. Oh, they're nice to me. They're, they're really good at using tactics. Okay, potentially I have. So, somewhere in here I have a hero. Really? Here's one. Dash. Okay. Somewhere in here there's another hero. Oh, there he is. He moved. Up in the front lines. Earth magic. Earth magic sounds good. Yeah, it's my it. That kind of sucks. Wind magic. Sure. Water magic. Take your chicago in there. You need to work on you need to work on that, mage. Okay. Everybody get together. Come on. We can just hope that the lizard four frog make allies. Come on. Nani attenda. Motto Tautanito. Come in, Naranezo. Okay. He sent a hell of an army here. But the guns are taking them out. This is a little bit of a little Stop your grudge battles with us. Yeah, this that he has nothing left after this. I yeah. mean, uh, that, that 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 was the final. That was the battle of the bulge. Yeah, that was everything. Chase him off to the map. Can we build a fortification now? I don't know. Just a row of sharp sticks. <laughs> yeah. Palisade. Ooh. 
Alcatraz on the frog. And... Oh, sure. Don't want to fight you right now. I would be all too happy to be friends with you. Wow, look at this. Yeah. These lizards, man. They're everywhere. They are. <laughs> yeah, Dar Tar Tar is saying we want peace with the lizards. <laughs> maybe, or maybe they're the greatest foe and I need to break them. In long term, you know. Well yeah, I want them to break them, but good luck right now. Okay. So what we're gonna do is port some of your army over. Port city. That's what I thought. Okay. Okay, what we're gonna do. This is it. This is eight squads. All I can do is fill them up. You wanna call break it two and a half hours? Yep. Okay, so we're down to just eight to just six of my squads left here. A monster snake. Recruit that snake. Wow. Whoa. Um, as Marguerite, some of them. Okay, it will not because it serves somebody else. Okay, so over here, what I'm going to do is I'm going to shuffle. Some of your people from port over. Yeah. Why are you moving people from Ivory to port? Do you need the other way around? Okay, now, yeah, this is it. This is my limit of squads. Just huh. hold on. Okay, what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to make recruitment. Go to Marguerite. Okay, yeah. now that I've cleared a squad, I can hire this person. A Viking, level 29. Oh, Viking? You want a Viking. Or an archer. Viking, Viking all the way. That person looks Boy, crazy. The, yeah, she was one of theirs. They kept doing the water, water blasts. Fest, yeah. That was what was the nightmare that I had to keep contending with. Yeah. Yeah, nice. <laughs> you want peace? You're in the wrong time, the wrong country. Okay. Now, where did they end up? Okay, I can't move them. But they're been recruited to strange places. Weird. I don't know why. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to shift this army to here. Yeah, this is overall I'm impressed. This is a really, this is a really cool game. So I can have pirates, bowmen's, or laborers. With you. I'll just make some pirates because this army doesn't have anything that's not ranged. Yeah, pirates are probably not exactly. You got the pirates who don't do anything. Right. We know how it goes. I'm going to shift these two to, th to there, and that will let me move these to here. Okay, that's as tough as I can make this point. Then I can push everything I have over to here, which I'm afraid isn't much anymore. Huh. Some of these guys leveled up to another, a whole nother thing. Yeah, musketeers are, they have long careers ahead of them. The ones that live. Yeah. Are they most likely to live? I think that you have a terrible swordsman policy here. Well, look at them. The ones that have survived are level 27 now. Yeah. The handful that live <laughs> have become I'm demons just, from hell. I'm just that tough. You could not understand the war. <laughs> so. Yep. They're up to 3,000 apiece to buy them. No wonder. <laughs> I mean, consider it. <laughs> I, I, could, I would not be hireable if I was a mercenary. <laughs> For your part, I'm like, nope, nope, any empire but yours. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> all right, that's all I can afford. So I've got 13,000 here to his... He's only 15,000 left. He's broken. Over here, we're looking at stuff... 
Unless the lizards attack, everybody is weaker than this army. So we should be okay. And we have new recruits like that Viking to bring in. Our aim needs to be to take that fortress. I think that's going to be the final battle today, is just the fort. Okay, Alcatraz and Lizards are now fighting. Yay! Please, destroy each other. Alcatraz is doing really good, so. Oh, desert people. Sure. <laughs> Anything to strengthen you. <laughs> we need you to not die. <laughs> Yet. <laughs> we thought you were Whoa, be that's a major war. Like a holy shit level war. They actually ran out of turns. Wow. That was huge. So, let's look at that fort. Still better than me. But, I'm not exactly at my best right now. We can probably move those heroes over to you now. Yes, that's the plan. Okay, ship that away to surplus. Okay. Now. Ooh, level twenty-nine. Yeah, no, this is that. This is the one that did the wave of death. Yep. Loyalty is at a hundred across the board. That's nice. Yay! I didn't even know loyalty was a problem. <laughs> it seems like a very, in some ways, it seems like a very simplified tactics game, which I can get behind. Who needs an army? Hey, Balder! You were the w level 25 <laughs> fire mage! <laughs> he was the one from the tutorial. Yeah. A squire? What girl? What? Hello? <laughs> Who are you talking to? <laughs> uh oh. I'm gonna marry that. Albert! Girl. Albert Veen Rutherford. That seems Very like noble. Yeah, he seems like somebody who'd want to hang out with musket pirates or whatever we are. I don't want to get myself dirty, but okay. So we should be able to get more commander things from my squads. Most of my squads don't have a hero or anything. They're just a bunch of guys. You, you, you guys are just writing the story together, roughing it. Just all of you. Pirates, fire mages, and snow mages. And you accept bowmen and archers. I want to get musketmen in with you guys. Trust me, muskets are the future. Nuh-uh, people with bows. Middle Ages. Well, all right, Elsa. There, a mix of fire and ice. Okay. Yeah, I should make plenty of water for her. Okay, and some archers. All right, at this point, we now have 18,000. We're a match. Next turn, I can send that in. I need... I don't have archers anywhere I can send in to support this stack. <sighs> Unfortunately. All right, so that's going to have to be that. Maybe they'll hit me again and level me up more. Maybe, maybe. can always hope. Probably not. They're broken and they know it. They're this is literally their only country left. Yeah, they surrounded from every side. Yeah, when I started breaking their armies and stuff, they just, I ruined them. They had to pull too much of their troops back to deal with me. Like, just that crazy thing on your arm. Yeah. The dragon knights are losing to the frogs. <laughs> frogs are dangerous. Apparently so. That was a close fight. Again? You've Dude. only got like one town. He's desperate for money. He's trying. He's he's at negative 120 in funds. Yeah. Oh, no, we're broke. that's me. Okay. No, I'm fine. I'm fine. I just uh. Oh. Huh. 
He's rated as being almost equivalent to me in might. Hmm. <laughs> Somehow I think my board position is a little better than yours, sir. Sure. Anyway, I need my money right now. I need to, to do a battle. Oh, I think he's a... gone. The lion is done. I think there's entire anime seasons going on down there. <laughs> That's what it looks like to me. Okay. Um, is there anybody there to deploy? Big guys. Hey! Three reinforcements. Oh, hey. A hero. Yeah, I'm the only guy who matters among these three. I'm the... Interesting. Rich New guy. New mechanic. Now I understand how that works. Oh! I'm in the fort. <laughs> Get inside so, the walls, you idiots! Hurry! Right. I have no idea where the attacks are going to come from. Yep. This Oops. is a heck of a fortress, but um... The 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 where the hell is the attack going to come from? You guys are stuck outside the walls. Gosh. We're inside the walls. No, 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 you're three guys. Your reinforcements. They're stuck outside the walls. They're right there. They're the three dot white dots so on the map. In yeah, they're coming. I'm just trying to b put everything together. Did he get in through the door? Okay, he did. Yeah. Okay, okay. I thought for a minute he was locked out. I was like, geez. And you have the wave master in this one. Oh, look, they're there. Oh, in they're frogs, so they move quickly in water, huh? So there's lizards. Lizards, okay. I guess some lizards do. Do you have any heroes? Uh... Hunting dogs. Yes. Let me see you there. Oh, the dog girl. Where? Um, I don't see her. She, she keeps talking, so she's in there somewhere. Is that her over there? I don't know who that is. Oh, can you click her right there? Hurl stone! Porcelain bomb! Yeah, our heroes aren't exactly about skills. But mostly about having guns. So many lizards. This is a great they're lizard war. They're not doing good. They're, they're winning this. Pull them back! You musketeers! Bubbles. Bubble beam. Shit, we're gonna lose this fight. Did run? No. No. Wala! Kore wa atashi kara no present yo! Our fortress has a terrible weakness. Wizard people. Now yeah, this went well. No! Don't go into the water! Shoot back! Yes, yeah, swim around with a musket. Load and fire it in the water. Brilliant. This is what it should look like. You guys up on the wall, shooting the water up there. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, you have no heroes left. She's holding. She's been healing herself and fighting this whole time down in this corner. With the support from just a little, little contingent of rifles. We're gonna hold, barely. God. Our rifles have a really nice range. Okay, I'm surprised how the turnarounds in this game is. 
Jeez. Yeah, I guess it's a good thing it's easy mode because you have to get through this. It's not thing. easy, it's normal. Oh, sorry, normal. I don't want to die. Rock your eyes, it's no use. It's a little bit of a little bit of a little bit of a little bit of a I think two thirds of my army in that. I think more like five A's. No. Everybody. No, more like two thirds. <sighs> they acted because they reinforced. Okay. Now. You get this Damn. fire mage. Get your butt over there. And this squire or whatever. Okay. There you go. That's what you got. Oh. He's managed to reinforce this even heavier. People attack him. Yeah. You definitely need to reinforce the, the Grease Island. I it's going to be attacked again. It is. It is, it is, it is. I'd buy men for it. I don't know what else to do. So many awesome guys of that kind. Yeah. What range units? What units that can melee? Just a bit. Might be nice. More musketeer. Oh, musketeer cat. I can't afford them. Oh. I'm sure you'll be very useful, Mr. Furrier. <laughs> Save it. Well, isn't that interesting? Well, I got that guy. Musketeer Captain. Sorry, can't afford him. We'll take the cheap ones. You just gotta level up as you go. Yeah. Sorry, we can only do the cheap stuff. Alright. Anyway, so we've got knights, we've got mages, we've got... All right. That's the limit. Okay, and our reinforcement guy over here. Mamlocks. Well, they've got a ranged attack. Or snakes. Snakes. <laughs> they weren't expecting snakes. <laughs> What's your backup, guys? Snakes from the Frostlands. <laughs> oh, that's the worst kind. Those are poisonous. <laughs> Ice snakes. Go! Gives a whole new definition to frostbite. Uh, okay, let's Ow. hope. I'm hoping that he his army either he attacks something and moves troops out, or he gets attacked and loses men. Whoa, that died. Yep. Still, the elves are doing quite well. Ooh, the dragon riders are in, on the ropes oh. now. He's attacking me again. He just, he just can't get over you. Go. Like, oh, you the Oh, 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 there, guys. Back up. It's like your wave master, definitely. And um, get ready to send some water in their direction. Oh, Okay. If I'm holding my mouse over here, the pause button stops working. I have to be holding it out here for it to pause. Okay. Water magic aqua 2. Ooh. Electric magic C. Ice magic E. Fire magic E. Moon tide blade. Release a surge of water from the blade created by mad water magic. That seems to be it. The mo that's the Moontide Blade. 
some fun with uh, mind defense for a while. Um bring it with you on four. Ken wa tokui ja nae kedo dekinai wa ke ja nae. Ike! Soko da! Ya o hanatte kudasai. Teki o chikasukase te o narimasen. No. Shizue. Nido to ikan de kunna. Katte mo senbei ga bundoreru wa ke ja nae nda yo na. It's okay. a simple attack, but it's great. Flee for your um, lives. Currently, I'm enjoying idling to rule the gods the most. There was a time when there's one called Kitten's Game, which I briefly loved. It got boring and repetitive after a while, but uh, Kitten Game was, was pretty fun. You also like Candy Box? Though so that's a little bit more, more of a strange one, though. I need my money right now. I'm... Yeah. Wow, look at these big three-way alliances. That's massive. So, uh, World War seems to be going on. But the elves, oof. You just didn't lose a single guy. There we in there. All archers. Lizard men are dangerous, but I worry more about these alliances. So he broke himself on me. A dock. This is it. Last move. Yeah, no, this game has actually been surprisingly fun just to walk into. We knew nothing uh, coming in. All my ice mages died and all the fire mages lived. Is this a <laughs> sign? Let it go. Let it go. I can't let it go. So I can have <laughs> up to 24 squads in there. That would be the place to own. Alright, we got an Aztec temple. Inside of the fortress. That is a strange... That is a strange... That is a strange... That is a strange... That is a You don't need to charge them. I'm not sure. I'm much better if they're attacking me. Yeah. So just punch you guys together. Like that, yeah. I'm much better if they come at me. Just, you're good as long as you're not fighting Gandhi. What, nukes? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. I'm literally Three. just... Whoa! No, Whoa. No, don't do that. I'm literally just starting idling to rule the gods, and I have seen a bit more of the kitten one. Thanks for the help. I'm trying to find something to play while I'm idling. だめです。いつかなきっと、ワンクランクランクランクランクランクランクランクランクランクランクランクランクランクランクランクランクランクランクランクランクランクランクランクランクランクランクランクランクランクランクランクランクランクランクランクランクランクランクランクランクランクランク
<笑>俺が今日焦ったばかりに。略奪は今後どうなるんだ。待ってっとじゅんね。ドーンと変わっていく。ガルガルやろうは及びじゃねえからね。シーズンね。ドーンと変わっていく。ガルガルやろうは及
Well, ah. you're weaker than all of them. Well, Alfenheim and the frogs. The elves and the frogs are in the lead. The dwarves that are my best buddies are losing badly. Allied country, knights, knight, kingdom of Gug, Mackin, rival country, Alfenheim, and Alcatraz. You guys are dead. Yeah. So, so yeah, the elves and the frogs are dominant. The lizards are actually in third place. With the desert people actually rivaling them. Though when you consider board positions, I'm not too confident. The desert people have made a remarkable recovery, but... I'm surprised that you're not listed, because you should be on the list. No, this is uh, this is diplomacy. Ah, uh, okay, can't make diplomacy with yourself. Yeah. I, thought, I thought I was going to rank show you at least where you were. I relative. don't know where I am, but let's see if we can figure this out. I have 24,000 here. 36, 37... 37,000. 37,000, and that's with my forces depleted. So, in the grand scheme, I'm actually... Better than Alcatraz. Well, yeah, better than Alcatraz, better than the Dwarves, better than the Dragon Knights, but they're on their way out. But not a match for Gug or Elves. I'm not a match for the Lizards, but the Lizards... Look at their board position. They're just in the middle of everything. There's no way they're gonna they're gonna continue like this. I think they're gonna be gugged. The problem, the the biggest thing is they have these little dwarfin nation that's very weak over here. As soon as that buffer is wiped out by something like the elves, they're toast. Yeah. Um. Actually, in that regards, the desert people are in a much better border they're position. They're just gonna be pushed south. Yeah, the, but actually the desert people, they only have to defend three cities right now. Mm -hmm. Which isn't so bad at all. The lizards, they have one, two, three, four, five, six points they have to defend. So, now you know. Hadrix's Marshall plan, shipping money to the desert people, paid off in the end. <laughs> they had made the recovery. They were down to like one town for a while. They were, well, they were hurting at one point. Yeah, I'm best friends with dwarves, sadly. They're not going to make it. I'm okay friends with the Dragon Knights. They're doomed. Come uh, on, dragons. You, you backed all the, the bad horses. Yeah, apparently. Bet on all the losers. But that's all right. I conquered my foe. I killed my... <laughs> you fought your battles and you won. Yeah. We have lots of high-level riflemen. Alcatraz... I don't know. I don't want to fight a war. I'm done. I'm just looking around. They actually have almost nothing on my border. Yeah, you can just eat them. Well, that would be bad, because then I'd have to defend multiple points. Yeah. I, the, you don't have the military to hold... Yeah, I know you're in a choke points. <sighs> yes, it's critical. That's what this stuff's all about. If... God, it's from here, the expanding becomes really messy. Yep. From here, there's no direction I could expand in that won't cause me to have to defend more points. So there may be a part two on this. If I were... Hey, don't go promising things. That's what I didn't promise. I said there may be. If I were to... Take... See, it depends on who I declare war on and who I try to court. I'd probably go on a with. northern campaign because that's easier to defend. Well, less junctures. Maybe, and I could try to tip the scales to give the dragon riders some some help here, if I were to fight this way. But on the other hand, I know that the el that the uh, lizard men are going to inevitably lose. If I made war with them specifically and tried to make friends with Alcatraz and the desert, um, I could profit from conquering this way. But that would leave me down here, and if the desert people keep Turned getting on. stronger, it would be really bad. Yeah. I suspect that um, you would want to own up to here, the Hellas Fortress, well, and that's looking, probably where you want to stop. Believe it or not, the desert is a really good place to conquer. Because I'd only have, if I'm already holding up here, I'd only have to hold this point and this point. I could go all the way down to here. Mm -hmm. And I would only be defending one, two, three, four points and holding half, you know, a, a, a good chunk of the map. Mm -hmm. 
Whereas if I wanted to go up here, I would have to hold... I could eventually get it down to like here. Yeah, and I mean, here that's very easy here. defensible. That's not so defensible, but once you conquer these areas, it'd be too. Um, it'd be. Yeah, that'd be a bit tricky. It just looks more complicated. The fact that this is a very weak thing I could push over, but if I could keep it alive. If I ignore this, Alcatraz is going to keep growing stronger. Stronger and stronger. Eventually, though, the elves in them are likely to come to blows. That actually it doesn't. Does, the demon, the, the crime flag does look a lot like the mark from Berserk. Mm. It is just a simple squiggly. Well, anyway, this is version 1.3. <laughs> oh. Turn 14. And until next time, and every time, this is Hadrix. And Schneider. Off. Bye.